Hi there guys, how you doing? Hope you're doing fine. Right, plain multi-rig. Let's bring that over there, so you can see. There it is, the plain, ordinary multi-rig, little counter sink, counterweight, and then up to a quick change loop. Put that away to one side. By the way, that's Suffolk 15 pound coated braid with a new pinpoint Nash twister seems to be working quite well and what I do is I do this okay can you see that PVA bag threaded over the loop there's the anti-tangle bit of anti-tangle there see that's threaded all the way through to the counterweight okay and then basically what happens is that will sit on the lake bed and dissolve and that little pop-up will sit above it, about an inch and a half. That's what I was trying to explain with the pictures I put, posted on the page earlier. But there it is, the little multi-rig PVA, or PVA multi-rig. So that will sit down on the bed, a little pop-up will sit above it, one little mouthful, well for a bigger carp anyway. And it is successful, it does work. So, hope you enjoy that. Give it a try. Yeah, you know, it's um I just want to take the multi rig. Some people are taking up another stage by putting um shrink shrink tube around this bit and to lock it in place, but that defeats the object of a multi rig. A multi rig should be you can change the hook really quickly. But with the shrink tube on there, nah. This will I can change the hook anytime I want. And there we go. Thanks guys.